Good evening, Vanessa. Hello. Ready for the class. Good evening, Morena. How are you tonight? Just fine. Excellent. Great. So, how was your day? Um, very busy. It's okay? Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. okay. Very busy? Yes, because um, just not, uh, this day I wore... Um, uh, in house, no. At home. At or... home, at home. Uh -huh. But um, I have uh, many problems. Mm. Yeah. Uh, sometimes it's kind of complex. Yeah, because uh, I try with uh, tenants. Yes. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, uh, my work is um, in account receivables. Okay. Uh, yeah. In this moment, it's complicated because uh, the uh, tenants don't have money <laughs> for pay. <laughs> uh, yeah. So it's it's a little bit uh, complex. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, it's complicated. Uh, our business is, uh, uh, I don't know, how do you say, arrendamiento in English? Leasing. Leasing. But if this leasing is, ¿Puedo uh, decir uh, en español? Yo entendía, yo entendía que leasing es cuando involucra eh, que hay cierto como desplazamiento de la prenda o que lo vas a vender al final del día. Pero es así, eh? o sea, porque nosotros arrendamos, arrendamos locales. Ok. Oh, I get it. Let me see what is the... Um, how do you say it? Yeah, but it's... Uh, yeah, it's leasing. Leasing, yeah, ok. So it's been like complex, yeah, because this situation now it's, it's difficult for some people. Yeah, many people because um, some tenants said, uh, sorry, but I don't know, uh, continue with the, the contract. Yes. Yeah, in this moment we have I think 10, ten, ten uh, areas. Empty. Uh, per, sorry? Empty. Empty, uh -huh. yes, yes. Um, in incomes, it's less, less incomes. Yes. They have gone down. Mm -hmm. They have decreased. Decreased? Yes, they have decreased. Uh, decreased, yeah, okay. Understand. Yeah, it's a problem. Hey, yeah. look, there's Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos is connecting right now. Hello, okay. Juan Carlos. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? How are you? I am just fine. Thank you. Fine. What about you? Um, excellent teacher. How was your day? 
excelling. Okay, good. That's a good attitude. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. And tell me, what did you do today? Um, uh, I have a problem with my car and... Ouch. What happened to your car? Tell me. Uh, I don't, I don't know. Uh, in reverse, um, is um, se, como que se apaga, se apaga, sí, sin, sin previo aviso cuando se mete retroceso. Entonces, en eso estamos. It's automatic. Yes, this is a problem. Uh, sensor or the ECU, the computer. Um, no, computer no. Is probably probably is sensor. Uh, yeah, the sensor. Es lo que me han dicho. Yeah, it could be the sensor. Sensor or or, or este um, bobina. Okay, so it's like it's like difficult. Yes. Yeah, because you have to be yeah. like checking and waiting. Yes, but, yes, it's it, it's. Uh, it's very difficult in uh, the mechanic. Uh, what model is your car? What? What model is your car? It is it, it's, it's a um, Axum Hyundai. Oh, Hyundai Axum. Yes. Uh, they are good. And th there are parts. That's important. Hyundai, there are parts. Yes. You can find the parts. Yes, is relative um, and they are not economic. that yeah, they are not that expensive. They no. are not too expensive. No. I mean, it's it's a price that you can work with. Mm, yes. Yeah, because some cars, man, the parts are terrible. Yes, is is in in this moment. Well, the car is is cool, but in in this moment, um, I don't know uh, the problem or problem. Um, not a cheat. Yeah, but oh. but. But the car is it's running it's okay. very good. Yeah, they are. Yes, yes. They are good. Yes. They are a good car. Well, let's see. Let's hope everything goes fine. Okay. Hey, there's Janari. Hello, Janari. How are you? Good evening, teacher. I'm very good. And you? I'm just fine. How was your day? Thank you. Hmm. Uh, Tiring and stressful. And really, really? Yeah, I couldn't have, I couldn't drink coffee early in the day, so I had a headache. Do you like coffee? Yeah, I love coffee. Me and, too. <laughs> and today, I could not drink coffee. Oh. So I got a headache. Headache. I, I got, I even got a toothache because my really? nerve, my nerves get like. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I love uh, coffee too, uh, and I have I have a headache if I can drink coffee. Yeah, that happens to me even. <laughs> even my okay. face feels like numb if I don't. Uh, okay. drink yeah, I need it. Hey, look, there's okay. Roxana. Hello, Roxana. How are you? Hello. Hello. Um, I'm fine. Right. Tell me, Roxana, how was your day? Um, uh, it was good. I work every all day. Ouch. 
Um, but it's, today is Friday. So you feel it's, it's more good. relaxed. Yeah, yes. it's Friday, you say tomorrow. You work tomorrow or not? No, I don't work. Oh, that's why you are like relaxed, happy. Yes. That's nice. So what do you do on Saturdays? Um, I work in the garden. Oh, really? Nice. Yes, I like I like working in the garden. And... You like gardening? Yes. Oh, that's like so. garden is uh, a big garden. <laughs> I have a lot of work. <laughs> okay, cool. That's great. Well, thank you, Roxana. Hey, there's Vicky. Hello, Vicky. Hello, teacher. How are you? Uh, I am tired. Tired? Why? Tell me. My work is hard. Okay. You have a mm -hmm. hard day? Hard day. Mm -hmm. Okay. Tell me, at what time did you arrive to your house today? Um, mm, seven? Seven p.m. Oh. Mm -hmm. A long day. A very long day. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, that's stressful. Well, thank you, Vicky. We will see. We will see. Don't worry. We are going to have fun today. Let's see. There's Juan Carlos. Hello, Juan Carlos. Me, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you tonight? Good, teacher. Great. Excellent. Excellent. Hey, look, there's Sylvia. Hello, Sylvia. Hello, teacher. How are you? Um, excellent. Excellent. Wow, that's the attitude. <laughs> uh, she's always smiling. That's good. So tell me, how was your day, Sylvia? Um, fine. A um, little tired. Oh. Okay, fine. what did you do? What did you do today? Um, Queso. Ah, eh, ¿Cómo diría? Cleaning, eh, ¿cómo le dije nada? Limpié los estantes del lugar donde yo coloco el producto okay. en mi trabajo. ¿Cómo podríamos decir I eso? clean the shelves. I clean, I clean, I clean the shelves. The shelves. I clean the table from my workplace. From my workplace. So you had a heavy day. Sí, es que porque yo lo general, por lo general, llego, ordeno el producto, después veo qué es lo que cabe, saco de la bodega y lo coloco. Y hago pedido también. Wow. Pero ahora no me dediqué a eso. Sí. Ajá. So today Pero ahora you, no me dediqué a eso. ¿Cómo? Were, today you were working in something different. Uh -huh. And more yeah. tiring, yeah, I can imagine. Well, don't worry. Today in this class, you are going to relax a little bit. We are going to talk about some funny things and some interesting things. Let's see. Do you remember, guys, the parts of the body? Yes, teacher. Okay, let's see, Janari, if it's true. Tell me, what is my foot? Foot? Yes. Yeah. Okay, perfect. Now let's see what is my toe, Janari. Um, dientes. Dientes, perdón. No, toe, toe. Ah, toe. Toe, 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 toe. Look toe. at the chat. Look at the chat. Los dedos de los pies. Oh, <laughs> de los perfect, pies. Roxana. Ah, yes, 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 yes. Excellent, excellent. No. Now tell me what is my <laughs> knee. Knee. Cuello. Mmm. Ni. Ni, 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 ni. Ah, ni, ni. Rosilla. Perfect, Vicky. Ah, excellent. <laughs> excellent. <laughs> now let's see. Let's see, guys. What is my waist? Cadera. Okay, no, no waist. No, waist. A little bit above. Un poquito sí, cintura. Oh, Cintura. perfect, Cintura. perfect. <laughs> yes, because what Roxana said are hips. Hips. 
Okay. Okay. This is simple. Leg. Pierna. Pierna. Okay. Pierna. What about uncle? If this is my foot, this is the uncle. Exactly. Thank you very much, Anna. Now let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, I got a good one. Wrist. What is my wrist? This is my wrist. This part. Muñeca. Yes, this is the wrist. Okay. What is the name of this? Elbow. Elbow, perfect, Juan Carlos. What about the whole thing? Arm. Arm. Arm, arm. perfect. Forearm. Okay, oh, the forearm is this. Mm -hmm. But the whole place is the arm. Mm. And then let's see, what is, what is this? Chest, chest, no. Yeah, chest, perfect. Chest. What about in a lady? <laughs> it's different. <laughs> dress. It's breast. 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 breast is the correct word, okay? <laughs> okay, what about here? Back. Back. Perfect. Now, what about this? Shoulder. Shoulder. Shoulders. Perfect. Shoulder. What about this? Neck. 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 Excellent. What about this? I don't know. Drop. <laughs> Draw. Drop. Draw. Perfect. Now let's see. We are going to the to the face. This is easy, okay? Let's do it. Uh, okay, what is this? Here, here. Excellent. Here. What about this? No, no, no. What about this? Come on, guys. Check. Six. Cheese. 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 What about this? Chin. 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 This is the chin. 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 Okay. What about what are these? Lips. 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 Perfect. And the whole thing? Mouth. 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 Perfect. Mouth. Uh -huh. Mouth. Mouth. Then? Mouth. Tongue. 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 Say it again, please. Tongue. 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 Okay. Okay, now, let's see. What about this? Uh, forehead. Her. Forehead. Forehead. And this? Hair. 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 Okay, Hair. let's see, let's see. Now, I don't know if you can see Carlos, Mr. Carlos Cruz. Carlos, you are going to be the model tonight. <laughs> Carlos is going to model for us. Okay, Carlos got hair on his face. So tell me, what is this? How do, you call, that? How do you call that hair? <laughs> I don't know how do you say. Somebody knows? Guys. Mustache. 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 Perfect. What about the rest of the hair here? Bar. 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 Excellent. <laughs> and what about, imagine that Carlos decides tomorrow to shave here and he just have hair here in this area. I'm team plus. That's a goatee. A goatee is when you have it, what we in Spanish call a uh, candado. Candado. That's goatee. Okay. Goatee. Yes. Goatee. 
So you see the parts of the body are simple. Let's see, what are we missing? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, what are these? Fingers. 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 What about this part? Nail. 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 Nail, Nail or fingernail. Fingernail. Okay. What do you call this? <laughs> Thumb. Oh, perfect. What about this? Little finger. Little, oh, baby finger. Pinky. <laughs> Little me. You can also you can also say pinky. Pinky. Yes, you can say pinky. Okay. Okay. Now let's see. Let's see. Are we missing something? Yes, we are missing something. Teeth. 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 Remember, teeth. teeth. It's Plural. Uh, two, two, two. Singular. Okay. Same the same as with feet. Feet is plural and foot singular. Okay. Teacher. Yes. Y muelas. Dientes. Molars. Mol Molars. These are canines. Canine colmillo. Yes. And how do you say in English cordales? I don't know. Wisdom teeth. Wisdom, wisdom. wisdom teeth. Sí. ¿Cómo dijo colmillo? ¿O cómo se Canines. Canines. Uh. Canines. And then you got the wisdom teeth. Okay, or the wisdom tooth if it's singular. Now you see the parts of the body are simple. And today we are going to talk about problems. Like right now, I have a I have a pain. I have a pain in my I don't remember. Capacious, yes. Neck. No, it's not exactly in my neck. It's mostly the, the, this muscle we got here. It's stress. It could be, or it could be because of the exercise. Sometimes that happens. Because yeah. sometimes you can, you have to be careful because you can pull, you can pull a muscle. You can pull a muscle. Do you know what is a muscle? Mm -mm. Muscle. Ah. Muscle. 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 Yeah, the one. Muscle. Yes, exactly. Sometimes you can pull a muscle. That's pull when you made too much es effort. Tirado. Yes. You just have a tiron, we say. That's to pull it. And some people can turn their muscle. Some people can turn it. Turn it is when the muscle like breaks. Okay? What we call desgarre. Mm. That's to have a torn muscle. Okay? Remember, we are talking about the parts of the body and muscles are also part of the body. And right now, let me see. Oh, a few, like an hour ago, I used to have a headache. I was, ha I mean, I, I had a headache and I was talking to Morena, I think that it could be perhaps of the, the lack of caffeine. I hadn't taken caffeine the whole day. So I had a headache and it felt terrible. And then I started doing exercise and after doing the exercise, I got a pain right here. So I think I have a pull, a pull muscle, okay? I will write a sentence for you. I have a pull <clears throat> muscle because I, I feel I I feel some pain. 
can you see what I write on the chat? Yes. Pueden ver las oraciones que les pongo en el chat. Okay. What is the meaning? What is yes. the meaning of pain? Dolor. 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 Eh, tirón. Tirón. Okay. Be careful and remember all this vocabulary because we are going to use it. We are going to use it. Everything we talk before the, the, the main topic is about the class. Todo ese vocabulario que usamos siempre en las conversaciones, no sé si se han dado cuenta, es porque lo vamos a usar en la parte gramatical. Mm -hmm. We always do yeah. it, so pay attention to it. So let's see. Uh, Carlos, tell me, do you like exercising? Uh, yes. But I don't have time to do. Okay. And do you practice any sport? I have... Um, one, ye uh, one year to don't, to don't do it. Without, without doing it. Okay, without doing it. Sin, sin, or without practicing. Okay, tell me, what's your favorite sport? Uh, las martial arts or art martials. Oh, martial uh, arts? Okay, what's your specialty? Jiu-Jitsu, Karate? Uh, I practice Taekwondo. Taekwondo, okay, nice. Kung Fu. I practice Ninjutsu. Oh, really? Excellent. Mm -hmm. That's great. But you are a dangerous person. Eh, no. <laughs> no. I practice, I practice 17 years. Oh, really? Great. Yes. Yeah. My son practices uh, kickboxing and MMA. Ah, okay. He's been practicing like for two years now. So he has fun with that. And he practices okay. here at home. Well, so, but do you you do some exercising at home? Do you have a routine? When I have time, yes. Okay. But if if I might have a, a one day, I'm asleep oh, the okay. middle of the day. Half, half of the day. Half, okay. But I think what you mean is la mitad del día. Okay. Half of the day, okay. Now, thank you very much, Carlos. Let's see, let's see. Juan Carlos, tell me, what's your favorite sport? My favorite sport is soccer. Okay, tell me, what parts of the body work the most in soccer? Sorry? What parts of the body work the most when you play soccer? ¿Qué parte del cuerpo usa más? Leg. When you play soccer. Uh, mm, feet. Okay. The feet um, and the, the head. Okay. The legs. Um, in the, the brain. Okay, good, excellent. It's a... Uh, in mm, only only is the the that's the ones you use the most thank you very much awesome. oh you are a goalkeeper okay you're a goalkeeper oh no keeper keeper keeper, keeper uh, goal kicker is the uh, home oh. but uh I am um, a midfielder. Midfielder? Midfielder. Yes. Okay, you mediocampista. That's midfielder. Yes. You uh, have the goalkeeper. You have a forward. Porter. You have forward and you have defense. Okay, yeah. In my no. case, I was I was bad for soccer. I was 
not good for playing soccer. I used to play more. Uh, I used to play soccer, but just okay. a little bit. I used to play basketball. That was the one that I liked. Basketball is yeah. very nice. Yeah. And I used to play basketball. I, I, like, and, I like the sport. And volleyball. I used to love volleyball. volleyball. Yes, I used to love playing volleyball. Well, thank you very much, Juan Carlos. It is nah. very nice, but... Yeah, it is. It's just that we don't practice it that much here in El Salvador. Now, let's see, let's see, Raquel. Hello, Raquel. Hi. Tell me, Raquel, what's your favorite sport? My favorite sport, um, I like to walk. Okay. Um, walk or jog? Um, walk. Um, walk. Caminar no. Oh, okay. I thought that's why I wrote jog because jogging is like trotar. Sometimes. Sometimes. Okay, tell me, what parts of the body are the ones that you work the most when you walk or jog? ¿Qué parte del cuerpo trabaja más? The fix, um, okay, fix. arms. Arm. Um, legs. Legs, perfect. Mm -hmm. Excellent, very well. Now let's talk with Rubilia. Hello, Rubilia. Hello, sir. How are you? I am fine. Okay, tell me, what's your favorite sport, Rovidia? My favorite sport is soccer. Okay. In, Do you... in basketball. What? At basketball. Basketball. Okay, tell yeah. me, what parts of the body work more in basketball? Could you hear me? What? what parts of the body work the most? ¿Qué parte del cuerpo trabaja más in basketball? Uh, Hello. They have. Okay, arms. They have. They have uh, a bit. Feet, yes. Also yeah. the back. Well, thank you very much, Rubidia. So you see, when we practice sport, we use different parts of the body. So let's remember the pronunciation. Remember, if you look at the vocabulary we place in the chat, we have knee, waist, hips, leg, ankle, wrist, arm, chest, breast, back, shoulder, neck, throat, Verb, guati, wisdom tea. And let's see, is there another part of the body that we have forgotten? Oh yeah, the, the ones related to the, what is this? The round thing? How is it called? Como se llama? Eyelash. Okay, I have, this is the eyebrow. I have eyelashes, eyelash. and then I have the eyes. 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 What, ab what about this? Nose. 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 Yeah, because a nose is a noodle. Mm. Okay. Uh, mm. Do you remember this? What are these? Cheeks. Remember, cheeks. cheeks. Remember this? Chin. Chin. And remember, Chin. this is throat. This is neck. Shoulders. Shoulders. Okay, I have a good one for you guys. What is the name of this? Cosquilla. <laughs> what is the name? Who knows? Shoulder. That's the armpit. 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 Yes. It's the place where you put the, the odor and so 
We don't have problems. Okay, just give me a second. Okay. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. We're going to work with something different right now. Let me share with you a small presentation we have prepared for you. Okay, let's see, and it goes like this. Beginners three, class four. Okay, the objective, by the end of the class, you will learn how to use have plus noun and fill plus adjective. Okay, have plus noun, simple. When we have the verb have, after the verb have, we put a noun. Cuando tenemos el verbo have, a veces le colocamos después de él otro nombre. I have a headache. I have a pain. I have a leg. I have a pull muscle. Okay, I have a car. I have a problem. All those words are nouns. Esas palabras que estamos mencionando después de have son nombre. Ok. You have a stomachache. He has a toothache. She has a pulled muscle. Ok. That's with the verb have. And remember that we, the conjugation of have is for the third person, he, she, and it, we use has. For the rest, we use have, okay? For he, she, and it, we use has. For the rest, I have, you have, we have, they have. And then we have he has, she has, it has. Let's continue. We have also feel. We know the verb feel, sentir. Usually, after the verb feel, you place an adjective. Normalmente, después del verbo feel, ponemos un adjetivo. I feel tired. You feel sick. He feels homesick. How do we say homesick in Spanish? Mm -hmm. oh, we will talk about it later. She feels stressed. Okay. Questions up to here? Preguntas. Homesick. The word homesick refers to imagine that you go to to the United States, and the first days you miss El Salvador, so you feel sad because you feel homesick. Cuando extrañamos el lugar del cual provenimos. We feel homesick, okay? That's why I told you. Like if we go to the United States, uh, the first week perhaps, or the second week, you're going to feel sad, depressed, because you miss El Salvador, and you cannot go there. In that moment, you feel homesick. Now you get it? Is it clear? Yes. Perfect. Perfect. Excellent. Let me check on something. Okay, let's see. Somebody's texting me that oh Hilda is coming. And Okay, perfect. Now let's see. And now we are going to do a small exercise, guys. We are going to be divided in groups, in pairs. And we are going to make an exercise similar to the ones we have been doing. But today the activity is a little bit different because it's not that much about asking and answering. Because you are going to ask just two questions. How do you feel today? Okay, the other person will answer like, Carlos, tell me, how do you feel today? Hello? 
Hello, Carlos. I feel tired. Okay, Carlos. I don't know why. I don't know why, but uh -oh, I feel but, this. But I'm asking you, why do you feel like that? Pero le pregunto, why do you feel like that? Yes, yes. I don't know. Well, you will have to to create or to say an idea. That's the, the main thing. Right now we are going to say, hold on. Uh, we are going to use the, oh, just those two questions in order to work in the conversation. Remember the questions are, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Ouch. Here. We say, how do you feel today and why do you feel like that? La pregunta son, ¿cómo se siente hoy y por qué se siente así? Okay. You got them, guys? Okay, perfect. Now, let's see, we are going to be divided into Pairs, let's see. Let's see. Groups. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, guys. You already got the invitation. Let's join the groups. And you? How do you feel today? I feel tired. Why do you feel like that? I have a lot of work in homeworks with my son. I have a hard day. You yes. have a hard day? Yes. Oh, sorry to hear that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> How do you feel today, Marina? I am feeling stressed and tired too. Okay. What do you feel like that? Because I have a hard day. Um, <laughs> in Friday. Porque ya es viernes también. Uh -huh. <laughs> Todo lo de la semana, vea. Creo que es. It, it's Friday, um, body. ¿Cómo se diría, teacher? Es, And es the body knows it. Ah, uh, es como el, es viernes y el cuerpo lo sabe. And the body knows it. Rubidia, <laughs> how do you feel today? I feel very good, then. What do you feel? What do you feel like that? Like? Like that. that. Why do you feel like that? La otra pregunta no la vi cómo se escribía, la verdad no. no. What, ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué te sientes así o de esa manera? Um, It is how, why? Why do you? feel like that. Why? Why do you feel like that? Uh, What do, why do you feel like that? Yes. A low stress response. Eh, no, no. Yes? Eh, no. Eh, only, only tired. Uh, I love my work, but it's 
is hard. Is is uh, difficult. Yes, but this is a job. Really? Yes. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. In this case, we Francisco, are... you don't say really, you say for real. For real, okay. For real. For real. For real. For real. Okay, teacher. Yes, in that moment, speak for the work because uh, Carlos feel very tired. Yeah, and he doesn't know why, he says. A lot of because work, perhaps? No, really, I work at work. I work uh, for for two weeks. Uh, since the cancel. Uh, okay. For twelve, twelve or thir thirteen hours of day. A day. Wow. Yes. Yeah. So everything, everything, all that stress adds up. Mm -hmm. The stress of. And I have a a headache. I have a muscle, muscle. Uh, muscle, to muscle, 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 muscle. 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 Okay. Well, guys, in one minute we go back. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. Okay, Carl. Okay, let's see, let's see, everybody's coming back. So, Sylvia, hello, Sylvia. Hello. Okay. Oh, hello, Sylvia. Tell me, Sylvia, uh, how do you feel today? I, I feel mm, tired. Okay, why do you feel like that? Um, more work, mucho trabajo. A lot, a lot of work. A lot for work, work, así. A lot of work. A lot of work. Okay, the expression is this. Look at the chat. A lot of work. But actually, actually, you can say a lot of, a lot of, a lot, a lot of. of, yes. A lot of. And I will explain why. Le voy a explicar por qué. Usually when we have, normalmente cuando tenemos una palabra que termina en T y la siguiente palabra comienza con vocal, unimos y se vuelve un solo sonido y la T se pronuncia como R, a lot of. In this case, as you have just one F, Como solo tenemos una F, that F is pronounced as a V. So the pronunciation is a lot of, a lot of a lot work. Of, okay. A lot, of, a lot of work. So you feel tired because you have a lot of work today. A lot of work. Thank you. Now let's see. Thank you, Silvia. Rubidia. Hello, Rubidia. Hello, teacher. Hi, Rubidia. Tell me, how do you feel today? I feel very good. Thank oh, you. Good. Tell me, why do you feel good? You are not tired? Not working today? Working. Yeah. Okay. What did you do today in your job? In your? In your job, in your work. What did you do today? Que hizo ahora? Um... Uh, I put, I put uh, lasagna. I cook lasagna. I cook lasagna. In your job? In, ¿En su trabajo? Yeah. <laughs> you cook in your job? Yes. 
school. Yes. Okay. So you are a chef? No. No, no chef. No chef. <laughs> okay. You cook lasagna. What else did you prepare? What else did you do today? ¿Qué más hizo este día? Um, I organized meeting. Organize. Organize meeting. Okay. Uh, uh, check the precast. Okay. Y, uh, Bill Clay. Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. Now, let's see. Mm -hmm. Roxana. Hello, Roxana. Hello, teacher. How do you feel today, Roxana? I feel good. Okay. Tell me why. You are not tired? No, because today is Friday and I can relax. Okay. Why can't you relax on Fridays? Not working on Saturdays? No, I don't work Saturdays. Oh, that's nice. So Saturday and Sunday is your day off. Yes. You relax. Okay, great. Tell me, what do you usually do on Fridays? On Fridays? Yes. In, in my work, um, yes. I write reports and reports and attend meetings. Okay. Reports. 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 And attend meetings. Attend. No attend. 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 You say attend. 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 Yes, the sound goes like up. Attend meetings. Attend and you say meetings. And you say reports. Reports. Okay. All right, re reports. Yes. In reports, the sound goes down. The stress goes down. Report. And in attend, it's attend. See? So you attend meetings and write reports. Yes. Perfect. Thank and, you. Okay. Thank you very much, Roxana. Francisco. Hello, Francisco. Hello, teacher. Tell me, Francisco, how do you feel today? Mm, I feel good and tired. Okay. <laughs> Tell me why do you feel tired? Um, because uh, this day I drive to my, my hub in El Salvador. To my job? Yeah, no, no, I drive to my hubs. In, oh, to your, to your in home? In San Salvador, yes. I, oh. I travel there to San Salvador, the, the Santana to San Salvador. Okay, listen. From Santana to San Salvador. Okay, uh, from Santana to San Salvador. Okay, how long does it take you to travel? Mm, this day, two hours. Two hours? Wow. Yes, the traffic jam is very difficult. Yeah, and do you commute every day or just on weekend? On weekend. Okay, commute is when you travel from your job to your house a big distance, okay? Yes. That's to commute. Okay, okay. So on Monday you go back. Yes, Monday uh, I travel from Santa from San Salvador to Santana. Okay, and tell me which day is more difficult the driving on Friday Friday afternoon or Monday morning? Mm, Friday afternoon. Oh really? Mm, yes, Monday is very flight. Okay, tell me, how long does it take you on Monday to get from your house to Santa Ana? One hour. Wow, so yes. half the time. Yes, it's uh, because in the morning I try for the 5, p 5 a.m. Okay. to Santa Ana. Okay, you, go, you leave your house at 5 a.m., so you are arriving at Santa Ana around 6 in the morning. Yes. Yes. Okay, nice. And you stay in Santa Ana the whole week? Yes. Okay, very interesting. Thank you. Now, okay. let's see, let's see, let's see. Vanessa, Vanessa. Okay, thank you, Carlos. Vanessa, hello. Hello, thank you, Carlos. Yeah, yeah. You're welcome. Tell me, Vanessa, how do you feel today? Uh, 
I'm tired. Tired? Why? What did you do today? Um, go with a different person. Okay. Uh, resolve. Uh, how do you say resolver? Resolve. Resolve. Solve. Solve, Solve problems. Uh, the other, the other person. Um, Okay, what type of problems do you solve? Um, uh, the problem is uh, um, the contables, numericos. Oh, really? So you're an accountant? Yes, accountant, uh, yes. And it's coming the end of the month. Yes. So next week, Carol is, uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, not Carol. Uh, I was thinking about a student that is asking for permission. Vanessa is going to be like, oh, very stressed. Yes, yes. Okay. The okay. final uh, month and the uh, initially. Okay, the end of the month and the begin. And the beginning, yes. Of the month. Yes. Okay, okay, don't worry. There's Carlos to help you. Yes, is how do you say work with me? Okay, he works with you. Yes, Carlos. Yeah, yeah he can cheer you up. He can cheer you cheer up. You, cheer you up. Do you see that expression on the chat? Cheer you up. That means to motivate you. <laughs> cheer you up. Yeah. Have you Ooh. seen Carlos can cheer you up next week? Mm. Ah, okay. <laughs> and Carlos, yes. Is like, yes. Carlos is like, yeah, sure, no problem. <laughs> Excellent. Have you seen the, the cheerleaders? Cheerleaders. Yeah. Cheerleaders are the ladies that motivate the people on the game. Uh -huh. So uh -huh. the verb cheer is to motivate. Okay. 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 To support, apoyar. Okay. Apoyar. That's to cheer. So Carlos is going to cheer you up. Okay, okay, sure. Yes. He's going to yes. go to your office and say, yes, you can, Vanessa, go, 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 do it. Go, okay. go, do it, do it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, thank you very much, Vanessa. Let's see, let's see. Thank you. Vicky, hello, Vicky. Hello, teacher. How do you feel today, Vicky? I feel tired. Why, Vicky? Why do you feel like that? Because hard day. Okay. A lot of work. What did you do? Um, I make report. Okay. And organize, how do you say? Organize. Organize meeting. Okay. And, and day, this day. Okay. Uh, junta Or directiva. Oh, the board. Um, yes. The board, the administrative board. Mm -hmm. Bar. I hate those yes. type of meetings. You mm -hmm. odious the people at reuniones. When you have to yes. when you have to meet with the board, man, it's terrible. Yes. Uh, in my case I don't like them. <laughs> in so, my case too. And at what time that the deal the board meets? Um at a Eight, 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 a.m. Eight a.m. Okay, from eight a.m. to to one p.m. or three oh. p.m. Depend. Ouch! It was a big meeting, a long meeting. Yes. Mm -hmm. What's the name of your company? Uh, Inversiones Simco. Okay. So, mm -hmm. in your case, you were stressed. Yes, teacher. Well, Today. Yeah. What? A, and the board meets just on Fridays. No. Um. Sometimes. Um. Different day. Oh, really? In in the month. Oh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I used to work in a in a company where the board meet. They meet every Tuesday. Mm. Every week. So the board meets mm -hmm. once a week. 
-hmm. and the coordinators meet uh, twice, once with the board and one just the coordinations. So it's mm -hmm. terrible, long hours. Sometimes you do not have time for lunch when the board meets. Oh, yes, teacher. Yeah. I maybe 3 p.m. lunch. Yeah, it's terrible. Mm -hmm. Well, but somebody said that's the job. Yes. Alguien dijo por ahí, that's the job. That's the job. Okay, mm -hmm. let's see who's missing. Who's missing? Alguien me falta. I know somebody's missing. Mm. You, teacher, how do you feel today? Oh, well, let me see. I feel a little bit tired because I have to, I have to drive uh, early in the morning and I have to go to get some medicines for my, for some relatives. And then I have to prepare classes. Then I have to go to the supermarket. After going to the supermarket, uh, well, it took me many hours, a lot of traffic. I hate traffic. Uh, <laughs> I got stressed. I didn't have breakfast nor lunch. Well, I had have, I have just one time of food around 3 p.m. So from, from the time I woke up until 3 p.m. was the first food I could have and then prepare class. But really, I have a lasagna. Yeah, but she didn't invite me. That's the problem. And let me see what else. Around six, I did my exercising. The routine from six to seven. From seven to seven thirty, I relax. Then a quick shower. Then I shave. I shave today. And then I'm in class. I have class up to 10 p.m. And after 10 p.m., I have to convert the video, upload the video to YouTube, and prepare the material for tomorrow's class. I have a class tomorrow early in the morning. So I am finishing today around 12 p.m. So my day is very long. I don't hear you. Congratulations. Welcome yeah. to the club. Well, you know, actually now I'm working less. Realmente hoy estoy trabajando menos. Because usually when there was not the pandemic, I used to wake up around 5 in the morning, or around 6, 5.36 in the morning. Around 7, I used to start teaching classes. I used to finish classes at 5 p.m. From 5 p.m. at 5 p.m., I used to travel all the way to San Jose Villanueva to teach another class. Finish that class around 7.38. Come back home around 9.30. Have dinner around that time. Go to sleep. On weekends, I used to work uh, Saturday morning at Garcia Flamenco. Saturday afternoon, uh, if not here with Regal, I used to work also for Universidad Don Bosco. Sunday, I used to teach uh, at the Universidad Don Bosco. It was from 12.30 to 6 p.m. And Sunday, I used to teach classes from 7 to 1.30 p.m. So I used to not to have any day off during the week. Yo normalmente no tenía días libres en la semana. So now it's less work. It's more relaxed for me to be online. So that was my day. Well, guys, tell me, what did we work with today? ¿Qué trabajamos hoy? I don't remember. I just forgot. Parts Let's, of the body. The part, uh, the parts of the body. What else? The body. Um, hey. Actually, and the verb have. The verb have and have. feel. Feel. Okay. Okay, yeah. with have we use a a noun or an adjective? A noun. A noun. Perfect. And with feel? It's an adjective. Adjective. It's an adjective. Like we put the examples, like I have a headache, I have a a neck pain. 
and with feel we say oh i feel stress stress is an adjective i feel tired i feel sleepy mm -hmm. okay i feel i feel sick you see so those are adjectives the adjectives usually you use them with feel and the nouns you we use them with uh, have okay any question about the class alguna pregunta no okay no. tomorrow morning i will post the 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 points that we need to check on the platform for next week okay Okay. Mañana por la mañana les voy a poner los puntos que vamos a trabajar en la plataforma, los videos que tienen que ver. Because remember, this class is a reinforcement of the job you do in the platform. Recuérdense que esta clase es un refuerzo de lo que resolvemos en la plataforma. It is very important that you work in the platform also. Okay? And any question you know, you can ask me. Y cualquier duda saben que pueden preguntarme. Okay? Thank you. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Thank you very much. See you, see you Monday. You. Take care. Good night, teacher. Good night. Bye. 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 Bye.